Hello Magic Community on YouTube, I'm T1 Glister Elf. I ended up getting three packs from Prize Support over at uh, FNM. Ended up going 3-1, but because of how top heavy the Prize Support is, I only end up getting three packs. All Oath of the Gatewatch, because there's still a good bit of value in that set, and a few cards for which I'm looking. And all Nyssa, because Nyssa, I'm a green mage at heart. I don't hate any of the colors, but I love me some green. It's my favorite to be sure. And it's in my favorite guild. I always do it this way. Alright, so, going off one at a time. We're going to start off with a Mighty Leap. For some good limited value. Let's <laughs> sneak preview there. Cultivator Drone. Expedite. Very nice. Uh, you'll see this in a video from me before too long. It's a uh, Legacy deck. Legacy. A Canopy Gorger. Kozilek's Translator. Lead by example, again limited value. Boulder Salvo, okay. Holdout Settlement, it's great in that set, in limited. Blinding Drone. Kozilek's Pathfinder, and you're seeing why it was so great in that set. Tranquil Expanse, shoutouts to Selesnia, my favorite guild. Storm Chaser Mage, because prowess is still a thing, right? Or uh, is it Storm? Devour in Flames. Okay, fair enough. And, let's see. So, we're going to start this one off at the side. What color is it? It is an Eldrazi card. It's one of those colorless bits. Uh, let's see. Is it a creature? It is. It's a 2-1. Okay, so on its own, it's a 2-1 Eldrazi that's a rare mythic. Uh, tell me. I, oh, what's its name? It's uh, Eldrazi Mimic, I think. No, no, it has one in black in the cost. Okay, Bearer of Silence. Huh, okay, well, fair enough. <laughs> um, I'm sure there's still some good uses for this. After all, when you get up to four mana, it's a Gatekeeper of Malakir, the Full Art Swamp, of course, and then a Scion token. Okay, so I might be able to build with Bearer of Silence. That's fair enough, I suppose. Let's, uh put you on the top, show you off a bit. Next, we're actually going to take it, we're going to flank that one with Eldrazi. That's how this works. Alright, see what I get out of this pack. Show me Nissa. Yeah, whatever, that's close enough. Instead, we'll, go, we'll start off with a core Scythe Master. Comparative Analysis. Actually, one of my favorite cards in the set at Common. Eldrazi Aggressor. Lead by example again. Shoutouts. Corpse Churn. That art. That art. Natural State. B -b -b Booyah. Gonna play you. Yeah, we'll, we'll still keep you in here, but you are going into a side deck, buddy. Containment Membrane. Bone Saw. Shoutouts to Bonesaw, sorry for you being banned at AGDQ, we'll see you next year. Vampire Envoy. Tajuru Pathwarden, okay. 5-4 Vigilance Trample. For our first Uncommon, Relief Captain. Then Null Caller. And then Iona's Blessing. Alright, now, once again, what do we have here? It's another Eldrazi card. Is it a creature? It is a 3-3, three, three. so 3-3 three, three Eldrazi in this set. I'm sure some of you have already figured it out. Oh, 3-3 three, three Eldrazi. Uh, Matter Reshaper was a 3-2, I think. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, it's Displacer! Hi, Eldrazi Displacer. How are you doing? <laughs> Good to see you, buddy. I will take that. I will take that every day. All day, every day. And then, uh, just a market card. Good for proxies and whatnot. <laughs> Alright, so I said we'd flank her with Eldrazi, and so far we're two for two. Alright, what's in this last one? We're gonna go with the mono Eldrazi packs. So far it's not been particularly hard as to what I would first pick in the first pack. It would be the rares. <laughs> Alright, so we have uh, Negate. Ma. Ooh, okay. Shoulder to shoulder. Umara Entangler. 
Saddleback Lajac? Lajic? Sorry, L A G A C. Another corpse churn. Cinder Hellion. Unknown Shores. Once again, good in this set for good reason. Gravity Negator. When it attacks a colorless, another creature gets flying. Alright, so for our first uncommon, Grip of the Royal. Then Allied Reinforcements. So it's Gideon for two turns. <laughs> Wall of Resurgence. Cool. Okay, I'll play that. I'll find a way to play it. I heard some people say that this could go into the blue-white list with uh, Reflector Mage gone. I don't know if I go quite that far. Uh, but if you're already running Fairgrounds Warden, maybe. Alright, let's see. So, we have... Is it... It's another Eldrazi. Good God. So, again, Mono Eldrazi. Alright, so... Trying to not reveal more than just the... It's a 4-3. It's a 4-3 Eldrazi. Is this one of the black... It's one of the black... Oh, oh, is this Inverter of Truth? Is that its name? Sifter of Skulls. Whenever another non-token creature you control dies, put a 1-1 colorless Eldrazi Scion creature token onto the battlefield, and then you can sack it for mana. Foil Plains, okay. Okay, and then there's an island. And then there's a zombie, a Zamboni. <laughs> Okay, well, I will gladly take this pack. That is, uh... Oh, that's a lot of Eldrazi, actually. Um... <laughs> I guess I ended up somehow in... Orzov Eldrazi for limited. Which I guess I'll take. I'll gladly take. <sighs> Pair of Silence, pretty good. Displacer, real good. Sifter of Skulls. I've never actually played with you before. Limited, including limited, uh, let alone constructed, so I don't know. This, maybe I'll try to work up some Eldrazi, a nice little homebrew for us all. Alright, well, take care. I'll see you later. Bye bye.